Well, Dana Davis is in, and it sounds exactly. like an answer to our prayers. Paying less money at the pump, that's what we all want to do, right? Exactly, less money. And it's a car that can go from zero to 60 miles an hour in about two minutes. And sure, the getup might be a little slow, but it can travel up to 900 miles on one tank of gas. Jack Talbert loves his 1981 Delta 88. Yeah, it's a cool car. It is. Um, the, they use these in uh, rap videos. <laughs> he especially loves passing by gas stations. On the highway, on average, it's 49 miles per gallon. And in town, Jack guesstimates he gets about 70 miles per gallon. The vintage Oldsmobile used to get 12 miles per gallon on the highway, but Jack did a little tinkering under the hood and converted his carburetor. Used a uh, exhaust coupler to make a vacuum canister, and what it does is it uh, basically rapidly accelerates the evaporation process of the gasoline, converts it into a true gas. The process is gasoline vaporization, which uses fuel vapors. The technology was co-developed by Jack's father, George Talbert, and Tom Ogle of El Paso, Texas in the 1970s. This is George Talbert's original prototype. Jack says the technology can work on any internal combustion engine that normally would burn propane or gasoline. According to the 2006 Fuel Economy Guide, two of the fuel economy leaders are the manual Honda Insight, which gets 60 miles per gallon in the city and 66 on the highway, and the automatic Toyota Prius, which gets 60 miles per gallon in the city and 51 on the highway. Jack says getting even higher miles per gallon of gas with vaporization technology is obtainable. 100 miles per gallon has been accomplished and verified before by Tom Ogle, and my father was getting around 80. Jack says car manufacturers have known about the vaporization technology for years, but if consumers are willing to pay high prices for gas, things probably won't change much. And we know that there's better technology out there. There's better hybrid technology. There's better fueling systems for cars. There's better cars that can be made. Can I ask that real quick? Sure. Okay. Okay. All right, I want this car. <laughs> we were just talking. I was, I was like, why don't all car makers do that? Well, essentially, um, what I was told is that they don't want to lose their shirts, so to speak, on, you know, busting out and trying new stuff. So instead, so, we'll lose our shirts, right? Yeah. For sure. so, so how many times has he actually been to the gas station? He bought it in November? Right, he bought it in November of last year, and he's only stopped at the gas station five times. I think he's on to something. I think All so right. too. I think <laughs> so too. Exactly. And for more information about the converted Oldsmobile, gas, Oldsmobile or gasoline vaporization, you may call Jack Talbert at 785-280-1564. And if you have a special event happening in your community or if you want your town featured on Good Morning Kansas, please email me your ideas at dana.davis at 49abcnews.com.